Hey guys, Grant here. I'm not a car guy, but I still have to get around town. Are you intimidated by having a big, expensive, dangerous thing you don't know how to use? Are you embarrassed by how long it takes you to find the little button that pops your hood? Don't be. Here are five car tips for non-car people. Now, the most important thing you can do when your car is acting up is ignore it. Just pretend it's not happening. It's the same thing you do when you think you might have a cavity. Maybe it'll go away by itself? Hey, sometimes your computer fixes itself by magic, right? Well, your car does the same thing. If you do have to fix your car, remember, it's probably a fuse. Why? Because you've heard of fuses. Luckily, this is an easy fix. It's just lots and lots of electricity. To fix it, do it the same way you fix your fuse box at home. Just make all the things look like all the other things. If all the things look one way, and one thing looks another way, the one thing is the problem. Sorry, that got technical. Now, there's a very important step in all of car maintenance, calling your dad. Your dad seems to know a lot about cars, even though that's not his job. Maybe people his age just know more things. When you call, try to talk up any recent accomplishments at work to soften the blow of not having basic life skills. When he asks where he went wrong as a parent, tell him it's that he worked too much. When your car won't work, don't forget, you're spoiled. You're a soft person whose hands have never known a callus and whose mind has been turned to pudding by screens. This car is a luxury you don't deserve, and whatever unsmiling god there is has rightly judged that you're unfit to have such bounty. One must walk, as if on the way of the cross or the road to Mecca, to atone for the sins of gluttony and sloth that you, indeed all of us, are guilty of. Remember to bring your own grocery bags. Now, unlike this car, you may have a diesel engine. In that case, it might be a good idea to install a tachometer. This one has an inductive pickup designed to strap to the outside of your alternator to read rotation. And if you understand any of what I just said, please explain it to me in the comments, because I'm a little baby boy. Hey, it's Grant from College Humor. Click here to subscribe to the channel. Click here for more fun stuff. And, sorry, guys, it feels like I'm out. Am I out? I, Cause I can like, I can see the top of the camera. So it's, I, it, I, is this better? All right, it, it feels worse. Okay, uh, thanks for watching.